Hi everyone, thanks for checking in online for your latest weather forecast. It was certainly cooler today across the region and tonight downright cold, especially east of the Cascades where a frost and freeze warning is in effect for late tonight through Friday morning. Primarily the communities of Crescent, Chabot, Christmas Valley, Chiloquin, places like that could see temperatures down in the upper 20s and the lower 30s. Meantime, Here's what we're looking at. We've got this area of low pressure that dropped down out of Canada, brought in the cooler air across the area, even a couple of light rain showers in the northern portion of our state and in Washington state. That combined with high pressure off the coastline has given us some gusty winds as well, especially along the coast and through the mountain passes. Those winds will start to subside as we head towards the weekend, but tonight, and tomorrow still expect occasional gusty winds. Penpoint forecast tonight, just a few patchy clouds passing through here and there. As we head through to our Friday morning, uh, some patchy low clouds along portions of our coastal areas and a few clouds even sneaking their way into the Rogue Valley. But by afternoon, bright and sunny all across the area. And guess what? We'll just do that all over again on Saturday. So some patchy clouds in the morning hours. Follow that up with plenty of sunshine again for the afternoon. Here's what it looks like now across the region tomorrow in Bend, 65 degrees and sunny, breezy to windy at times and burns at 64, lower 70s, Portland and through the Willamette Valley and breezy up and down the Oregon and Northern California coastlines where temperatures tomorrow will range from 61 in North Bend to 64 in Gold Beach to 70 degrees in the Brookings area. East of the Cascades, we talked about those cold temperatures tonight. Now in Klamath Falls, we're not expecting a freeze, but still chilly, 39 degrees. 37 in Lakeview, 38 in Paisley, Crater Lake down to 29. Tomorrow, though, most of us 60s to as warm as 72 degrees, though, in the Klamath Falls area. Meanwhile, back here in the West Valleys, will be chilly tonight. Uh, down to 48 here in Medford, 44 Cave Junction, and in Wairika. Tomorrow is going to be a beautiful day. We become mostly sunny, highs in the 70s. Now for the weekend, we warm up a little more. We'll be in the mid 80s, it looks like, then trending back a little bit. Some clouds start to enter the picture next week. And there's a real small chance a shower might pop up Tuesday night or Wednesday. We'll keep an eye on that for you. Klamath Basin, beautiful weather for the weekend. You're looking at low 80s and then some clouds building up Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Some slight risk of showers there. At the coast, breezy for the next couple of days. Temperatures in the 60s and we keep it that way next week. An increasing marine layer though, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday could generate a couple of showers by the time we get to Wednesday. Northern California are headed to the 80s for the weekend. Otherwise, sunshine, then just like the rest of us, a few clouds into the picture next Wednesday and Thursday. Thanks again. We hope you have a great Thursday and Friday. And of course, you can always catch the latest forecast here or over the air at NBC5 News.